Hello, hello, this is Tom from Tom and Ruth Philippine Adventures. Today we're going to talk about new construction and uh, a little bit about it. It's what's you know happening here. And so I'm going to flip this around so you guys can see this. And, uh, this is a new house they're building across the street from a family member's house. Uh, they're always, always adding, adding here. You have to give them credit. Uh, never a dull moment. Uh, and what they're doing, they're building this house uh, for someone. It was going to be a business. Now, this is a business. Uh, Ruth's uncle <coughs> doesn't have the, he owns the property, but this is a business, a food business at one time. Really nice business. But they lasted about a year and went out. And now, uh, somebody else is in here now and they sell, so they have it for catering and things like that, and parties. Uh, pretty busy. And they just leased the land from uh, Ruth's uncle. He's on prime property here. This is downtown. This is close to the uh, bus terminal. The bus terminal is actually, you go back here about uh, 100 feet and make a right. And the bus terminal is right down the road there. So, um, but this property here is worth a lot of money. Um, uh, really a lot of money. But as you can see, they're building a small place here. I don't know if it's going to be, it looks kind of like it's going to be some type of uh, retail environment. More so than a house. I thought maybe a house, but the way the walls is constructed is a lot like this one here. These are retail. Uh, this used to be, uh, that used to be a hotel right there. That Marjorie used to be a hotel. Really nice hotel at one time. Top of the line place. But you can see it's a little run down a lot. That's the deal about the rains here and the sun. It just destroys the paint. You could have the best paint in the world and you're buying it, say, uh, you bring Glidden paint here and some of the paints they have, and it would uh, just have a hard time holding up here. The sun is so hard and the rains are so hard. I mean, the rain smells like, feels like small BBs hitting you when you're in it. But that was really a nice place at one time. When I first came here uh, seven years ago, it was pristine. It, it was really pristine. You go downstairs, there's a lobby, really beautiful lobby. Had a guard out there, uh, really nice place. But what happened, it was a American owner and he passed and the wife took it over and she's in the States now and sold it. She's in the States with another American husband. So, and she found a husband really quick too. Like really quick, and now that happens a lot. Once Filipina has a foreigner and something happens, passes, they usually find one pretty fast. So, you can sell all the concrete. Look at the concrete. Uh, this was all dirt road uh, a year ago. Now it's all concrete. You see the concrete and the concrete to add in there. So it's a lot of good stuff. And you see these tuk-tuks around a lot. Of course, as inflation hit here. Uh, the poor passengers are now paying 30 pesos to drive around now, one that used to be five and 10 pesos, now it's 30 pesos to go somewhere. So, I just kinda wanna show you that. I got my compadre here today, Omer. He's doing his thing. Uh, he's always watching out for things. As you can see, he's my watchdog. Mommy's in the house there. And so, we're here. Oh, it's a lottery place is what that is. So that's a lottery place, and see the lotto. So they go buy their lotto. So there you go. What else is going on with me? It's the same thing. We're in town. Uh, we went to the bank, put some money in the bank instead of taking it out, and um, we'll be heading back home soon. So I want to thank everybody for always watching my videos. God bless, and I'll see you guys next time.